Hey there, everyone. This is Pastor Roman D, and this is God's Promises. I'm so excited. Tonight at 7 p.m., we have the live experience on LitTVNetwork.com. LitTVNetwork.com. You can watch the live experience at 7 p.m. Central this Sunday morning, 10 a.m. live at a live church. I want to see you. I want to hear, see your comments. I want to feel your presence on social media, on YouTube, The Alive Church KC, on Facebook, Alive Church, The Alive Church KC.com. Go ahead and make sure you comment. And as we celebrate and our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ, as we continue our sermon series beyond generosity that reaches, and we're just so excited as we move closer to October 3rd, our first pastoral church anniversary. And so our scripture for today is Deuteronomy 8, 3 through 5 NIV. It says, he humbled you, causing you to hunger and then feeding you with manna, which neither you nor your fathers had known to teach you that man does not live on bread alone, but on every word that comes from the mouth of the Lord. Your clothes did not wear out and your feet did not swell during those 40 years. Know then in your heart that as a man disciplines his son, so the Lord your God disciplines you. And so our confession for today is my life is not sustained by food alone. My life is not sustained by worldly uh, material prosperity, but by every word that proceeds from the mouth of my father. I set his word continually before me, for it is life to me. My clothes do not wear out. My feet do not swell. As a father loves, disciplined, and deeply cares for his child, so does the Lord love me, disciplines me, and deeply cares for for me. So as you go about this day, understand that you live by the word, you move by the word, you operate by the word. The word is your final authority. And if the word says it, that settles it for us. We believe it. We receive it. Since the word says by his stripes, we are healed. We are healed. Since his word says that we are more than conquerors through him that love us, we are more than conquerors. Since his word says, I am fearfully and wonderfully made. No more would I tell myself I'm ugly. I'm stupid. I am fearfully and wonderfully made. So walk in the word. Allow the word to be your compass. Allow the word to be your God. And remember, we walk by faith and not by sight. Well, thank you so much for checking out our YouTube channel. Make sure that you're subscribed so that you do not miss a video. If you desire to be encouraged, educated, and energized to come alive in Christ by faith, make sure you check out our other videos.